diving into Doctor Who. Ooh, this is season 11, episode 7. Oh, I like the way that rhymed. Um, rhymes, rhymes, rhymes. Uh, guys, we have 8, 9, 10. There's only 10 episodes this season? Shut the front door. It looks like there's only... I was expecting to keep counting, y'all. You know, I don't know anything. Um, but it looks like there's only 10 episodes this season. And then we're getting to season 12. And we're not that far away from uh, wrapping up and catching up to Doctor Who. I know a lot of people ask me about um, the classic Doctor Whos. I know we talked about it very briefly. We will do a poll, guys. And you guys will let me know. Um, should I do a poll? Yeah. I'll do a poll. We'll do a poll when we get there, and then we'll see which Doctor Who classics we'll get into first. Um, I also do know about Torchwood. Uh, a subscriber did ask about am I getting back into Torchwood. You guys know I, I have been spacing it out. I got a little irritated with... Um, you guys right now. I'm not going to keep going over it. I'm so over talking about BBC Studios. Um... So, moving right along. Yes, so look for Torchwood. Um, you know that Sherlock Holmes is still waiting in the background being like, um, you said you're going to be watching me like two months ago. What's going on? We're getting there. Um, and I know there's some other students. Uh, by the way, years and years, um, if you guys have been watching that reaction, the first reaction was completely chopped up. They blocked it. The second reaction, they actually started to do that as well. I am in the dispute with, um, whatever company, it's not BBC Studios that runs years and years, but right now, um, that video is, it's viewable, and I believe I didn't have to edit anything down, but it's in dispute. So determining the dispute on if they're going to uphold blocking that will then determine if I'm going to watch years and years for everybody or wrap up years and years for my channel members and Patreon members only. I will make an announcement once I find out the results of this dispute that's going back and forth with that. Um, guys, you guys know, I'll say it once, I'll say it twice, all Doctor Who uh, for any reactor. If you guys are watching Doctor Who reactions, just know it's going to get blocked. It's going to get copyrighted. So definitely, if you like a uh, reactor, any reactor here on YouTube, shout out to all the reactors that love Doctor Who, that are doing Doctor Who reactions. Just please hit that like button, guys, for them, and also share their videos. Let's help support all the Doctor Who reactors out there. I am one of them, so please like and support me. Share share and liking and commenting is one of the things I've always asked for. They're free to do, um, and I always let you guys know if you want to see these full reactions, guys, um, they are available for my second and third tier here on this platform that will always copyright everybody, shh, as well as my other platform, Patreon. So once again, guys, if you want to support me and want to help support this channel and you would love to see Doctor Who and its full reactions, please join one of those platforms today. Also, to the subscriber that asked me about out. There are so this is wonderful subscriber. Um, I believe they're new to the channel that actually has uh, is helping me see which parts of episodes that are missing um, in my full reactions or something like that. Um, so shout out to them. Right now everything's a blur. I've been up since like four o'clock in the morning. But yes, so thank you to them, and we're going to continue to. I'm going to look up those uh, reactions and see where they are. I also know I'm running very low on my memory space on my other platform that holds all my full reactions. So I, what I think I'm going to do um, is maybe start getting rid of some older shows and maybe put them in the backup, on my backup uh, uh, external drive. And then uh, as we, pers as maybe as new people come and if they want to see those reactions, I'll re-upload them again. And until I get more space, let me tell you guys something. I know we're, gonna get, we're getting to Doctor Who, I promise. Um, but these, uh, the space, to hold all these full reactions. I was going to upgrade it as my light is going brighter and brighter like Jesus is coming through this ring light. Um, to hold the space is nothing, almost $400 for me to now um, upgrade and get more space on my damn platform. So, ciao! You guys know I put in the work. I am trying to get make all this content available for you guys and for you guys to have the best reactions uh, ever. And I need to buy a new ring light. So, let me get into this. You know, ADD is real, and I got it. Let's jump into Doctor Who. Let's find out exactly what the doctor has got to give. For the doctor. Ah, it's a complete man! And 
remember, if you want it, kablam it. Base postman. Help me. I do this job, so she doesn't end up like her dad. It's tough being away from family. If you want it, kablam it. Suspending all operations for a month, pending review. And I'm going to propose that kablam becomes a people-led company in future. Looking for good workers to join our management team? Not at all. If Dan hadn't have switched scanners, it would have been me in that test room. Uh, you sure you want to pop that? I like that. I actually really did like this episode. There's one thing that I have to say. An overall feeling about this series so far, most of these episodes for me seem to like last much longer than every other series that I've watched. Like, I feel like the other series when I was watching it, it started and it stopped. I was like, oh my god, it's over already? Um, I don't know if it's because like the stories are so di different than what I'm used to and so because I do have ED it is like like I'm just trying to like focus on the storytelling or maybe the storytelling has nothing to do with my ED maybe it has to do with like the way they tell these stories I actually really did enjoy this one I enjoyed this episode more than no, I liked the last episode too. I really did like the last episode. I liked this episode. I really did because I understood the whole story. I just felt like it was so long and I don't know why. I, honestly, I watched this right now and I feel like I watched something for like almost two hours. No lie. I don't know. It might be just me being dramatic, but like that's literally how I feel. Um, overall though, I understood the story. I can't believe. You know, also, I feel like this, the, maybe because the budget is like so high it seems um but I feel like these deaths in the, these series are like whoa you know what I mean like he got blown up in front of us I was like I don't know if the doctor I took the doctor like I'm sure in other series the doctor would let people you know die like if there was this situation but I just feel like it it's just it's hitting different you guys understand what I'm saying it's just these deaths are just hitting different. Um, overall, though, I really did enjoy it. I would rate this. I'm not going to lie to you. I would give this a 9 because I really did like the whole overall feel of it. I really enjoyed the storytelling. I feel like if we just cut down some other stuff. Why does the doctor, she always, I feel like she's always Superwoman when she has like the little, um, the, the scanner, the sonic thing, screwdriver. She's always like, I'm like, girl, just go like this. <laughs> You know, I want, I really do. If I ever get into Doctor Who, like if they ask me if I could audition for Doctor Who, I would. Um, and I would totally be, I would love to be a villain, but I want to be, if anything, if they, if they were like, okay, here's a long list of villains and one could be like, you know, like you guys know Superman and his villain was like Bozo or something like that. Um, I think it's like that, which was like literally the same, kind of like how the Doctor and the Master is. I would like to be like that, but not really like, um, like the Doctor. I'd be, but I want to have like a sonic screwdriver and just go like this. You know, I feel like two of them, like lightsabers. Girl, I'll be, I'll be the baddest Bia Bia ever. And anyway, that would be my name, Bia Bia. <laughs> Anyways, yes, I would give this a nine, guys. Please like this video, please share this video, comment down below what you thought about this episode, and I'll see you guys next time with more Doctor Who. Bye.